Hey everyone, this is Dan Sparse, and today we are playing some Crusader Kings 2. This is probably at the moment my most played and one of my most favorite games. So let's get right into it. Um, disclaimer, I'm not actually very good at this game, so if if you want like videos on actually how to learn how to play and how to play properly and successfully, I'll leave some links in the description below to some channels that I like that um, that play this game more efficiently and you can actually learn stuff. Um, if you're interested. Um, we're gonna play... Um, I think I trust Iron Man the saves for Iron Man to play Iron Man, so we're gonna do that. Um, um, let's see... Now, I am playing with the India DLC. I have all the DLC on. This is the one game I buy almost every single piece of DLC for. So we have everything on. Sword of Islam, Legacy of Rome, Sunset Invasion. Very controversial, but I leave it on because I, <laughs> I think it's hilarious. The Republic, Old Gods, Sons of Abraham, Rajas of India. They're all on. So let's. Um, and we have Iron Man enabled. So let's just do. Let's start on the Old Gods. The earliest start date, which is where I like to normally start, and we'll just pick a random character, see what happens. All right. Uh, the Thakur Kapardin of Goa. Um, here. Well, let's. Let's go right into it. See what happens. Now, um, when I play CK2, I... Oops. This is... I'm playing this right after downloading it onto my new computer. So all this stuff is still there. Um, so yeah. Now the... As I was going to say, what I like to do with CK2 is I like to sort of role play. Um, what I mean by that is, you have your character, right, and you have their traits, so I like to choose decisions based on those traits, and sort of see what happens, and see how long we can survive, which is essentially it. Um, as I said, I'm not very good at the game, um, and I've only played an indie game once, as uh, Sri Lanka. Uh, at least, yeah, that's Sri Lanka. What am I? Um, it didn't last too long. I got like up in here, but then all of these guys came down and crushed me. So yeah, let's let's check our ruler out first. We are Thakir Kapardin of Goa of the Thana Shilahara House. We are Marathi and Hindu. We are a thrifty clerk. Uh, Kshatriya, Kshatriya, I guess. Uh, which means we are from a warrior and king hierarchy, second in second in the caste hierarchy. So we are pretty high up there. Um, we are the same as our ruler. I don't remember exactly what's the highest cast. If it's the, um. Yeah, it's the Brahmins. Which are the, the religious. In the game, they're like the religious people. Um, we are a Shaivist. Or 
I guess that means we worship Shiva, I'm guessing. We are kind, temperate, ambitious, and arbitrary. So up until here, we have some we have pretty good traits. Then we get to this. And that sucks. Let's see what titles do we have. We have Goa. And then we also have Fauna. We have two. I did not realize that. It's very interesting. Now, the religion where we are is Jain. But we are Hindu. Hmm. That's going to be a bit of a problem. Um. I hope you can hear me over the music. It's kind of loud on my end. Let's see, and we can make the Duchy of Konkana, which is this strip of land right here. So that's probably what we should do. So I think first things first is let's address these things. Choose an input. Well, let's check our wife first. Our wife is a cleric. She's the same as us. She's brave, she's lustful, she's just, she's gluttonous. <sighs> she's okay. Not, uh, what's this? Paragon of Enlightenment. Hmm. I think I want to improve our stewardship. It's always a good thing. And we have an unmarried heir, so let's see if we can find an heir, a uh, marriage for our heir. I like checking this tab first, because these generally are the best matches, like in terms of status. But it doesn't seem like there's... Uh, and I usually check the stewardship, or the intrigue. Hmm. Seeing if there's anyone who has... no. So let's go into the character tab. Let's see if we can find a... oops, that's not what I wanted. A genius. Uh, my religion, yes. Let's... women. Mike. Um, any. Hello. She's a genius. That's a good trait. Could we get her? I wonder. Arrange a marriage. No, not with not with me, my son, and genius lady. Let's do it. <laughs> she's a lowborn, but she's a genius. Oops. Um which might be a good which I think will be good in the long run. Um now let's do our council. So let's just do a quick check, see if we have anyone randomly generated in our court who is better. No. Okay. So this is our chancellor. And what I'm going to do with our chancellor is okay. Yeah, I'm I'm still not sh used to the uh, the symbols for the Indian. Uh, nations, so okay, that's where our king is. So I'm going to improve dip diplomacy with him. And then I'm going to. We're not at war with anyone for now, so I think I'm just going to research military tech. I'm going to collect some taxes. Study tech, build spy or scheme. Now, can we. No, we cannot. But technology, let's, let's see if we can find a place of high technology. Because normally you want to go to Constantinople, get some tech. But, um, zero six. let's just look around. Oh, what was that? There was a, there was a... Zero seven seven over here. Oh, wait. I thought I. Um. 
and uh, we're looking for white. Okay, so they have a lot of white, white, white. So. Seems to be there's really any good places, I don't think. I think this is the, the best place. So we'll just go there, I guess. And then, um, we don't have a head of a religion, right? No. You know what? Um, Proselytize, research cultural tech, improve religion. Let's just research cultural tech. Because there's no. From what I heard, I, I don't think there's a penalty between the religions in India. And I'm like, I don't think he hates me because we're different religions. Oh no, he does. Huh. But he's Jain, so he doesn't like to fight. At least he shouldn't like to fight. So I think that's all, so let's go ahead and get started. I'll increase the speed 3. I've decided to institute limited crown authority. What is it currently at? Autonomous. He's trying to increase crown authority. Um, uh, sure. Oh, throw out wealth, or prestige. Some, some wealth at the start would be a good idea. Suvrata has arrived in your court. That's my daughter-in-law. Can I get her to convert? No. Now what is she from? She's from... Right, she's a Buddhist. She, she doesn't have the caste. She's not someone of the caste. But she's a genius, so hopefully she'll bring that into... Oh, there's a war. Keep this up. I keep pressing WASD thinking that moves, but no, it's the arrow keys. Um, there's a war going on. What is this? Uh, Paula and Pratira. So these two are at war. Um, let's just... You know, we're fairly minor, we're very minor at the moment. Um, I thought that was me for a second, I was like, what? Yeah, I need money to create that. Just a fact, let's see if we can do any intrigue. She's a patron deity. Don't I already have a patron? Isn't that what this is? I thought that's what that was. Tiger hunt is a good idea, but I want to save up some money so I can make so I can make the duchy right away as soon as possible. Um, because. Well, just because. Do, do. You know, and while all this is going on. Oh! The rise of the Shia. The schism at the heart of Islam dates back to its earliest days. The majority Sunnis have long persecuted the followers of Ali, the Shias, forcing them into hiding. The partisans of Ali to look to his descendants for leadership, but they are forced to keep their ancestry secret. 
Now, though, the Shias are mobilizing their strength behind a boy whom they claim to be Ali's rightful heir and imam. Other Islamic jurists claim that the boy is clearly a fraud, but to his followers, he is the person they have been waiting for, and now they flock to his banner. I actually read a <clears throat> very interesting book that I never finished about the split between Sunnis and Shia. It's a very interesting read and gives you... Uh, if I can find it, I'll put a link in the description on it, I think. That might be too controversial, but if you're curious, ask me and I'll let you know. Um, I read a, it, It's a very interesting book and I should go back and reread it and finish it about the split between Sunni and Shia. And it really gives you sort of a good overview, you know, about the Middle East and why things in the Middle East at least partially are the way they are in terms of the different uh, Middle Eastern nations dealing with each other. It's, it's very interesting. Uh, I need a new steward. My steward died. You... Uh, you're terrible. Well, there's this guy and this guy. This guy's Hindu. He likes me more, so... There you are. Taxes. The finger thing means taxes. Let's t well, let's just see what's around the world today. Europe is still It's a mess, but not as much of a mess as it could be. Um You know, none of the carlings seem to be doing much at the moment. Let's actually take a look. Oh, wait. Does Brittany always have that little bit at the start? I don't think so. Um, let me check. History. Eight sixty-six. Huh. Interesting. I keep. Uh, uh, but yeah, let's take a look at Carling. That is one, two, three, four, five, six nations that are all of the same dynasty. So if we keep checking back over here as we play the game, you'll see, you know, Italy will sometimes be huge, Lotharingia, something. I find in my games it's usually Italy, Lotharingia, or West Fran East Francia, or East Francia. I don't know how it's pronounced. Um, swallows it up. West, the West, what is France, doesn't seem to really do very well in my games. That anyway. Oh my God. Ah. Uh. Byzantine seem to be doing okay. Kazaria, which is Jewish. Um, in the they re they also added another Jewish. Oh, Hungary exists now. There, a book without a title was pushed into my hands by a hooded man, clad in midnight blue. Something was said, but was lost in the confusion. The book was still there. So, what would my guy do? Hey, wait. Or it wants me to read it. Now, karma. There's karma. I want the prestige, so I'm going to choose illumination. Uh oh, are we at war? We are. Uh, rush. Rush Trakuda is declared war on Boja for what is it? Fedora. So here. Is that really it? This little this 
little thing. Yeah. Seems hardly worth it. This little spit. The book is gibberish, but also enlightening. But even if I struggle with some chapters, its mystery still engrosses me. Something is concealed in the book's language, and I am determined to find out what. The secrets will be mine. Waha, cough, cough, cough. Intense study. Let's do intense study. I actually don't know. Oh, God. I need to stop doing that. <clears throat> the secret within the book still eluded me after several weeks of intense study, wasted time, and wasted ink. The man couldn't be anything but a maniac, filling precious parchment with malarkey and incomprehensible symbols. I learned to love books instead. Okay, so... Oh, castle infrastructure increased. Awesome. Still waiting to create our duchy title. Because then we get a free thing on him. Harm indeed. It's a shame. He's not one of my counselors, is he? No. Now, does this guy have any allies? No. Alright, so. Because I'm going to have to go to war. Can I go to war with him now? I need to cast this bell eye. So I need to create this title so I can get a cast this bell eye and then declare war. Um, yeah. <sighs> Europe at this start is pretty... Oh, I got a granddaughter. Not exactly what I wanted, though. Actions. Hmm. Not interested in any of those. So yeah, this early game is a bit it's a bit boring. Now he is He's going out of his way to convert people, but he has not yet converted me. So, I'm curious, maybe I have a better relationship, but no. Not yet. Three thirty-six. A month. So, uh, let's check elsewhere, see what's going on. Oh! Oh, what is this? Basically, it's. Do you want charitable or greedy? Gotta take the greedy. Did I get it? Nope. Money is always a good thing in this game. You can never have too much money. This is our tech. <sighs> oh. Kazaria is having a civil war. Expected. It usually happens. I'll stop this video probably once we make the title. Because I don't. I don't see anything interesting happening so far. We're 
We're getting really close, though. Really close. 197. We are so close. Minimal city taxes. Sure, why not? I'll support you. I don't know what they were at before. I probably should have checked. What is this? The Deccan Empire. It's down there. That is interesting. Hmm. Anyway, I'm getting really close. Come on up. Oh, there we are. Boom. Now, let's see if we can. I can't, I can't, I can't ask to vacillate him? Huh. What is his, he probably has nothing, right? His troops, 196, 224, 341, my troop. Wait, I can just go here. You know what? I think in the next video, we will declare war on this little guy. And complete our duchy. Until next time, this is Dance Bars. Like, comment, subscribe, leave me questions. Bye.